Should you have the idea that an employer is someone to con, that the formula for work is 40% effort and 60% coffee breaks, small talk, and excuses, if work is a necessary evil, don't work for a cancer. Intuition is his thing, and he'll have you charted on a built-in radar screen each moment of the working day. You won't know how he knows things. He doesn't. He picks them out of the air. There is only one word a cancer knows in business. That word is more. More effort, more product, more profit. The crab combines the hard shell of practicality with the soft inner stuff of imagination and intuition, which spells for a successful leader. The only trouble is, if he likes you, you'll find it hard to quit. Cancers don't like to let go of anything. You need an extra hand right now. It's a scheme, and you want someone to go along. If it hits, it'll be a real killing. But presently, all you can pay is, well, not much. If that's your story, don't hire a cancer. He's not looking for a big killing. He wants to put something solid together. He believes in the sure thing and the sure dollar. He may bet a long shot at the track, but he doesn't gamble much with time or energy. A position must offer him a chance to build a future and to feather his nest. In return, you'll get a full effort, a reliable worker, and he'll go round the clock when he has to. He'll hang on until the thing is done. And if you forget to write something down, ask him. He'll remember. Cancers don't like to let go of anything.